Hey guys, so it's Thursday and we're in this hurricane. But we'll probably lose power, so got my generator out, plugged in. I'm gonna crank this thing up. Actually, we'll just go ahead and crank it up right now, right? Turn that on. Open the fuel. So these are my chargers. So all I got to do is throw this transfer switch. And we'll have that power coming in, but let's see where we're at here. Set up the charger first. All right, where are we at? There we go. So it's at 10%. Uh, we can up that to 20 for starters. Oh. And uh, I already turned off the stuff in the house, so I like to turn everything off. So we're just running off utility. So the reason I'm going to run this now is because we got 78% on the battery. But, you know, if we lose power, I'd like to have some more in there. So I'm going to go ahead and put that generator. Now we got power up to here. It's going to qualify it, make sure it's clean enough power to run the chargers. There we go. Click down. What am I missing here? We're not getting anything yet, but that should crank up in a minute here. I'm going to turn off the output as well, just to be sure. Okay, now we're getting 24 amps. And I'm going to let it go for 10 minutes, um, just 24 amps, just to warm up and then I'll come back and crank it up some more. All right, so we're all warmed up. I'm gonna go ahead and crank this up a little bit. So you can see that. Charger set up. We're gonna take it to 40%. So we got 25 amps. Gonna crank up, you'll hear the generator. All right, so it's cranking up 72 amps. So I've got two 60 amp chargers and the inverters there, and all I'm doing, all I'm doing is charging up this battery bank. That's the whole point. All right, you just want to get this battery bank charged up to maybe 95 percent or so from 78. And that way, if the power goes out, we can run off those batteries all night. Okay, so went ahead and cranked that up to 80%. I mean the uh, charging rate and uh, so now we're at 97 amps 55 volts right around you know, five six thousand watts coming in we're up to 80 percent I'm gonna let this roll so we get to about 95 power hasn't got out yet that's good all right so I'm up in my office now and I thought I'd show you this real quick so here's a security system so when I'm sitting here working, I can, you know, see what's going on all around the property. Here's the uh, charging. So we're at 96 amps, 83%. It's been going for about half an hour. There's the generator. So I can, you know, keep an eye on it. If it burst into flames, I can uh, do something about it. <laughs> all right. Uh, I've got 16 of these cameras. 
kind of cool. Just look around the property. There's the garden and such. But anyway, just thought I'd show you that's a good way to just put a security camera on your stuff and you can monitor it while you're, in this case, I'll be editing up this video. All right, guys, so it's been about an hour and a half and we're at 95%. I did drop the percentage down a little bit, so it's 67 amps going in right now. What we're gonna do is go ahead and cut this off. So I'm just gonna drop the breaker. There we go. And so I'm not gonna shut the generator off right away though. I'm gonna let it run for a few more minutes to do a little bit of a cool down. And there's one more thing I wanna show you is that was charging off the generator, but I, I can charge this off the utility. And to do that, I just come over here. This is a, it's a 60 amp breaker, maybe a 55, off this sub panel, which comes over to here. And just like the generators on this side, now I can pop the utility on that side. And we're just gonna do the same thing. It's gonna qualify the utility crank those chargers up and now we're pulling off the utility and that'll the amps will ramp up in a sec here so as long as you still got power you can you can charge off the utility now I never do this I've only done this like three times just for demonstration I've, ne I've never charged this bank off the utility so I have enough generators that have to be exercised once every two or three months that I whenever uh, Whenever I need to, I just use those. But that is utility charging batteries now. All right, guys, so anyway, I don't think things are gonna get too bad here. Uh, Daytona's looking rough though, so we gotta get over there and see how that's going. Um, we have a house that's about three football fields from where you see all the stuff on TV, where the houses are getting washed into the water. Our house is right behind that. You can see it in some of those shots. So we'll have to check that one out. But things here aren't looking too bad. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next one.